of our key sponsors is Lutronic. Now, Lutronic do lasers. You do do lasers, don't you? But yes. so many different kinds. Yes. It's quite hard to know where to start. How yeah. do you start to explain what you offer? Okay, so Lutronic is a company that was established in South Korea over 20 years ago. Tonight, we're going to be demonstrating our uh, Genius. Ooh, yes. Um, and this is our radio frequency microneedling device. Okay. We have seven different devices in our portfolio. Yeah. Various lasers, hair removals, vascular lasers, um, and then our radio frequency microneedling is one of our core uh, products. Okay. And this is for skin tightening, um, uh, volumization, reducing wrinkles, <laughs> scarring, things, things like that. And with all the different treatments you've got, you can probably treat a massive Many. different things that people yes. present with. Yes, so we're able to target pretty much any skin concern that comes our way, all skin types, yeah. um, quite effectively, specifically sure. pigmentation, skin tightening, anti-aging. Yeah. These are sort of the key things that people ask for. And do you still have that one where you have to zap the charcoal off the face? Yes. And it's actually not as tough as it looks, Correct. but it's a lot of fun. Yes, that's our, that? our Hollywood Spectra. Hollywood that, Spectra, That is the device, we call it the Hollywood Peel. Yeah. Um, the carbon is designed to matter the skin, smooth out yeah. the, the tone, reduce pore size, and it is a very yeah. fun treatment to do. So is that quite a good one to start with if people don't know the brand or yes, what it might definitely. do? Yes, definitely. Okay. It's very, um, it's, it's a nice entry level facial to have. There's yeah. no downtime associated with it. Okay. Not many risks, not much, um, you know, concerns around that. So it's a nice little red carpet facial that you can have. Perfect. And I know you, you've got Kevin Williams speaking yes. later. We're going to catch that talk too. Yeah. Uh, and he knows just he knows just everything about lasers of any sort. Oh yes, he? we're so lucky to have yeah. him. He's the, he's our laser guru, as we call him. Yeah. So he'll be doing a talk on. I believe it's going to be on our total skin solution. So yeah. our um, so one of our laser devices, as well as the as well as the genius. Fantastic. Okay, looking yeah. forward to it. Thank you. Now um, here we have a treat for anybody who is interested in lasers. This is the wonderful Kevin Williams, who is a laser expert of such high standing that it's hard to know where to um, where to begin. Um, who I've known for a while, and, and you'll hear talking about lasers in general, but Neutronic in particular this evening. I've invited you in to come and have a chat because I know your expertise across this whole sector. So can, could you sort of give a brief introduction to yourself of how you came to be working in the laser field and you know how, how you know all that you know about it now? Okay, so um, thank you for inviting me. It's a um, pleasure to be here. So for me, laser's been all my career. I was fortunate enough that when I was in university to meet an inspirational lecturer who said, Kevin, you should come and work with me and we should come and work on lasers. So I changed my career then to work on laser engineering. So that was probably 38 years ago. I've been fortunate that I've been involved in designing the world's first hair removal system and then in lots of technologies and so over the last 35 years I've held various different positions from technology to running clinics and in the last 10 years I've been building up my own training company so I get to use all the best technology um, we've of course because we're well known people will happily give us different technology to use and our latest venture is um, as you mentioned is working with uh, Lutronics Okay, and um, what we are meant to be talking about in particular for Lutronic is combining treatments. Um, I think the idea of combining treatments in lasers always seems quite unusual if people aren't used to this. Um, what sort of lasers get combined when you're talking about laser combination treatments? Well, I think, um, first of all, we have to think, of, well, why do we want to combine technologies? And that's, now we're having a much better understanding of perhaps what a patient is looking for. So you don't just come in with one condition. If I was to remove some of your redness, then maybe we'll pick up on the pigmentation or, or, on, the, or on maybe lines or wrinkles or maybe, or maybe loose tissue. So the idea behind combining therapies is that we can use the best modality for the different layers of the tissue to produce the best result. So for years, I've always looked at combining technologies. So recently now, I had the opportunity to work with Lutronix, and they've brought out this amazing thing called Total Skin Solutions. Yes, now what, what, what's that? Yeah, what, what's that? <laughs> so Total Skin Solutions is technology they've brought out to combine four different technologies. 
So first of all, they combine, uh, most people would have heard of microneedling. So they use microneedling to go into the tissue. They then deliver radio frequency so we can tighten up the areas and tighten up the jawline to give a lift in effect, but also to target any deep wrinkles or scarring. So that's the first two stages. Then they have the most coolest laser that I've used for a long time, which is called a thelium laser. And the thelium laser is a wavelength that is just below the ablation zone. So it's sub-ablative. Can what you explain it, what ablative is? So yeah. sub-ablative means that it's able to create channels in the tissue without ablating tissue. So what that allows us to do then is to completely remodel the epidermis. So it's very good for, say, taking away pigmentation, redness. But the coolest part of all, because it's able to create these micro channels that stay open, they then have their own products, so drug delivery, into the tissue. And the problem when you try and use to deliver drugs into the tissue, you get very little absorption. But they've been able to find a way to have, instead of one or two nanoparticles, it's six to seven layers. And they're able to deliver 90% of that drug to tissue. So now what you're able to do is say, well, this particular condition is pigmentation. Therefore, I'll choose a product to target the pigmentation. Or it may be redness, or it may be that we want to put a vitamin A to boost collagen production. So they're able to combine the whole thing. And if you look at their website and follow them, you'll see that patients have had Total Skin Solutions have this most amazing result afterwards. People ask me, well, is it painful? Um, I've had lucky enough I can have the treatments. You know, it's, yeah. it's uncomfortable, but you need to make sure you're anaesthetized. I made the mistake of having my first treatment. I said, oh, I'm hardcore. I'll be okay. Don't worry. Yeah, I've any made anesthesia. that mistake too. I'll be okay. <laughs> I, I wouldn't make that mistake again, but it's quite tolerable, the treatment. Now, one of the other more exciting things, and as a company, they're really out in touch with the marketplace. They're launching, and it's not quite out yet, but I only found out about it today. Um, they're launching this amazing app, which you'll all be able to get download. And it's, um, it's called, the company behind it's called Seriderm. And it's an app which has got AI intelligence that you can scan your face, it'll map the face. It'll tell you exactly what it thinks is wrong. And then it'll, you'll have a menu to select the appropriate treatment. But this treatment is not just coming into the clinic. You'll, they'll recommend you to the clinic. Then the clinic will supply you then with 15 days pre-treatment. Then you'll come in for the right treatment with the right laser and the right equipment or the right whatever the equipment is. Then 15 days post. And then it'll recommend the schedule of number of treatments. So it's exciting. It's never been done before. It's a new for the industry. This sounds absolutely amazing. Um, I was, I was going to say, I'm a great one for always telling people to go and find a great practitioner to get themselves assessed. So I was going to say, do I really want AI assessing my face and telling me what treatment I should have? But then I was thinking, I know from like dermatologists' websites, um, from dermatology websites, uh, AI is actually really good at analysing skin, as good as, or sometimes better than professionals. So. Um, is this kind of replacing the practice, or do you get a practitioner saying, yes, the AI is right, that you should have this treatment? Yeah, so you're never going to get away from not using a practitioner, because okay. it's always <laughs> best to go somewhere with experience. Yeah. What the app is going to do is drive you to the right clinics, because there are lots of people, and you know, I've all my life been in lasers. I know the good places to go to, and I know the places to avoid. What the app will do, and the people using high-end equipment like Lutronics is some of the most expensive equipment. They're all good people are going to be using it. So there's, there's going to be no clinics on the app that aren't, I would say, of good quality. So yes, you'd still have to see, of course, see the practitioner. And because there may be other things that the app can't pick up, but it's going to give you a really good starting point and send you to the right person. Okay. Right. I will definitely look forward to having a play with that. I, I always want to either be asking practitioners or surgeons um, when I'm feeling strong, what would they do to my face if I can get a bit of technology to do it as well. Now, I, I feel lasers are kind of not back in fashion. I mean, it seems a silly thing to say to you when you've been working in this field the whole time, but I felt um, there hasn't been so much talk of lasers maybe 
um, until five years ago, people it started to pick up again. Is is that just the sort of fashion thing from my perspective in aesthetics, or are lasers getting a lot cleverer than what we've been used to? Is that why they appear to be having more impact in the non-surgical space? I think that the marketplace was stagnated. People were too hung up on. A lot of companies make a lot of money out of hair removal, so that sort of took over. And they were vascular, traditional vascular lasers, which were available. But there's been this whole new generation of technology coming forward and with new development. You know, if you'd asked me 20 years ago, I'd never heard of a thelium laser, but this new exciting technology coming out and people are realizing that we have to do a little bit more. And I think that what companies have done quite well they're working with practitioners to develop the right equipment, not just scientists like myself saying this develops something for the sake of it. Sure. So I think there has been a big improvement in the last five years. Okay. Um, and, and also, from way back, I certainly used to think of lasers as the, the old-fashioned ablative, i.e. burn everything off kind of laser treatments. And now many lasers um, offer treatments that are done in lower level and in more stages so uh, that that's been quite an addition to the field hasn't it yeah well um the early skin resurfacing days if anyone's as old as me can remember it we'd use a co2 laser to burn off layers of the face and we would be you know it would be acceptable to have six weeks downtime that's not acceptable anymore so the biggest innovation was to what's called fractionating a beam. It's where you take a beam and take it into lots of micro beams so you can make micro zones in the tissue. Then rather than do one heavy treatment, you can then say, well, let's do three treatments. We know that if we do a treatment, the collagen level is going to rise up by, say, 84%. If we can do it four weeks later, we can get it to rise up to 200%. So what it's allowed us to be able to do is realize that it's much better to do three treatments and then get an overall better result. Yeah, and, uh, and, and the key thing with laser, as well as taking down the pigmentation, it really is making this massive regeneration in the skin, all that collagen stimulation, isn't it? Yeah, um, absolutely, it makes a big difference because it not just, and, and the great thing about some of the things like CO2 lasers, if you can get a fractionated CO2 laser, I think it's an ultimate treatment because it not just stimulates collagen, it stimulates elastin as well. And the key to it, as, I, as we talked about, is having three lower treatments and having them spaced a month apart rather than having one aggressive treatment. Yeah. Um, I think we're going to have to stop there because we're out of time. But Kevin, thank you so much. Absolute treat talking with you. Kevin Williams. <laughs>